All right, let's try some of these on. I love these. These are so cute. They're similar to the ones I have, but something like this. I don't know. These are similar. Even on these, everybody has to. Okay, these are too uncomfortable. Like no, I can barely see because my eyes are so dilated. All right. These are these are pretty good too. Okay, so of course the glasses I was looking at were super expensive. So here's the new options. We have these, which I actually really like. I think I'm just gonna go with these. They do the job and they're like under what my insurance pays. And then I have these, similar. They're really similar, it's just the color, kind of. And then back to these. These are like what I started off with. Okay, so out of my eye appointment, it was so cool getting to see Dr. Grand or my friend Karina. We were friends in like second grade and it was like so cool that like now she's an optometrist. The guy like totally ran that. Well, there's no stop sign, but he could have easily run me over. But it was so nice seeing her and it's not every day that like your childhood friend is like your optometrist now. It's crazy. But I'm gonna stop and get some Starbucks and yeah. Okay, so my eyes are still like really dilated. I do have to drive because I need to go to the pharmacy, but I got my Starbucks and um, I just made a little reel of Piper's, Piper's little time at Snowfall. It was so cute. Uh, but basically my eyes look all good and it's so cool that like my second grade, like really good friend is now like my optometrist. I still can't get over that. I think that's so cool. I'm so happy for her. Um, yeah, like she's always been so smart. So um, we definitely need to like catch up and everything. And yeah, so I'm gonna go home. Oh, there's a cute little lab over there. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go home and I do need to do an everything shower and eat before I take um, Piper to the groomer because her grooming appointment is very soon. So, her grooming appointment is at 3.30, so I do have some time, but you know, I wanna like do my everything shower and stuff so like when I get home from her grooming, I can like curl my hair because tomorrow we're going to New York, like I said. That's the game plan. Hopefully everything is like smooth sailing. Okay, so I've done my everything shower and basically I am so tired, but have to take my doggy to grooming. As you can see, there she is, right over there. There she is, Piper, look over here. No? All right. Well, anyway, going to take her to grooming and then I kind of want to like map out the day for tomorrow and then Kyra can just change whatever she wants. I don't know, I am definitely not the friend to do this, but like we don't really have a game plan and I just like to have like some sort of like idea or structure so then you're just not like, okay, we're here. So I have like four things in mind that I want to do. And then if she doesn't want to do one, it's fine. We can just like swap it. But also too, I don't want like most of our time like at the places to be like traveling. So I'm hoping these places are like kind of close together. Yeah, I don't know. But anyway, um, we're going to definitely take an Uber from the airport to the city and it is gonna be expensive, but like time is money and I don't wanna be on the subway for like an hour because we're only there for that one day. Like if we were gonna be there for like three days or even like two days, I wouldn't mind like an hour, but because like of time, like I don't mind just paying a little extra. So we have like, you know, that half an hour could be like walking around the city or something, you know what I mean? Like just having that time to actually do stuff would be great so that's what I'm gonna do kind of when Piper I don't know why this car is going so slow but anyway and that's what I'm gonna be doing when Piper's at her grooming appointment that's pretty much it I guess I just I don't know and also too this car is like frustrating me because it's going like two miles an hour okay if you guys remember last time I brought my dog for grooming. She pooped like on the road, literally. Well now, she's taking a poop. And I was not dumb and I brought uh, poop bags. So that's always good. Come on. She does not like getting groomed as you can tell. 
but we made it to Wolfgang. Okay, so I have this list here and this is what I proposed to my friend. Like again, I am no, I'm no expert in making itineraries. So this is why it looks like weird and probably not the best, but I tried and it gives me like an idea of like locations and stuff and honestly I'm just gonna propose if she wants to go somewhere and do something like we're both adults like we can go and do whatever we want but this is like my little list and yeah so first um, we land in LaGuardia I didn't put any times because like honestly I just don't know and then uh, Ralph's coffee because like that's just like a famous place and then next we have San Ambrose because I need to try the princess cake and then Bergdorf Goodman because that's like I've heard this girl say it's the promised land so like I want to get a Christmas ornament too there and then woman ranked for ice skating and we could probably do like lunch and then Rockefeller Center because it's like a must and then Hudson Yards maybe to finish but again we only have one day so like I don't know how this is gonna work out but I tried and this is what I came up with. I noticed too that I forgot um, Macy's and that's a must when going to New York during Christmas. So I added that and it's right next to Hudson Yards. So it's like eight minutes away. And I was just told uh, my friend that I'm like, hey, if we wanna do Subway, you're gonna have to do that part because like I don't, I mean, I could if you know I wanted to, but I'm really bad with directions. So like, I mean, I can flag down a taxi, no problem. So. I don't know what she wants to do, uh, but yeah. Um, I was looking up taxi costs and I mean, it is kind of pricey, but again, like in my opinion, like I was saying, like time is money. So you might just like have to pay a little bit more to like save time. Or I mean, the subway is probably faster too, but I'm just like, I don't know how to do that. I mean, it's probably easier than it looks, but I don't know. Oh, there's my girl. Oh my gosh, thank you. Oh You're so cute. Yes, you are. Look at you. Thank you. She's still a little bit damp. Yeah, it's um, okay. We didn't want to stress her out. With right. The sound of the Lord. Exactly. Yeah, but she's so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't. Pick a girl. Thank you. So we had a different person do Piper's grooming today because um, our normal groomer had like an emergency. So, um, yeah, I just think that she, she did an okay job. I just like the way Adriana does her grooming a little bit better because she did get a trim and it's not horrible, but you can see like the line where it's like been cut around the ears. Piper, I don't know if you can tell, but, and then she trimmed the tail. Look at the tail. Like you could see kind of like how it's choppy. So yeah, I mean, it's not horrible. At least she's clean. And, like, I think Adriana, like, takes more fur out of her, like, the undercoat. So, I don't know. I think I might call. I'll just call back later and reschedule an appointment and make sure it's with Adriana. Because I'm not as happy with her grooming this time around. But, I mean, she's still, like, she's fine. Isn't that right, Piper? At least she didn't get, like, shaved. You know what I mean? So, look at her little cross paws. I think that is going to be where I'm going to end the video because I don't have like any more plans really and I do want to edit this. I don't know if I'll have like enough time. Probably not, but my friend Kyra is coming over because we're getting up super early and then I'm starting a new vlog, which is going to be super fun. And yeah, New York is tomorrow, which is crazy. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.